In this video, I'm going to show you one of the most common things you'll probably do with Uscript in Unity, and that is setting up a trigger in your scene and then using it in Uscript in order to fire off logic. So let's get started. What I have here is a simple scene with a player controller, two pillars, and a light. So the idea is we're going to put a trigger between the two pillars that'll change the color in this light. So the first thing we're going to want to do is put a trigger in the world. So we're going to go up to Game Object, create an empty Game Object, and we'll call it Trigger. Now we need to assign a collider component to it in order to turn it into a trigger. So we'll go up to Component, Physics, and we'll use a box collider. We'll make sure his trigger is checked, and now we'll size it and put it in place. So let's make this 8, 4, and 2. We'll just put it between the pillars. Good enough. Save the scene. And now we're ready to go into Uscript and set up our trigger. Go up Tools, Detox Studios, Uscript Editor, and we have a blank scene. The first thing we're going to want to do is put in a trigger event. So go Events, Trigger Events. And we need to tell Uscript what trigger we want to trigger the event node. Grab our trigger, drag and drop it in, hook it up. And now we're ready to actually tell our light to change color. To do that, we need two things. First, we need to set color. So go to Actions, Set Variable, Place the Set Color. Hook that up to the On Enter trigger. For its value, we'll make it red. And now we need to go get the light property in order to tell the light itself to change its color. So to do that, we need to use a Reflected node. So we go into our scene, we need the property for the light, find the light section, here's color, hook this up, and for the instance we're going to use my light. Hit save, give it a name, we'll call it main. Sign it to the master game object, and we're good to go. Hit play. Now we go through the trigger, the light should turn red. And there you have it. It's very easy to set up a trigger and use it in Uscript. See you next time.